Today's recipe is a spin-off of a mug cake. It's going to be called a lava cake. Very straightforward, very easy, just one minor adjustment to give it a little bit better presentation and also to make it taste a little bit better because that's what we're cooking these recipes for, right? Pretty straightforward. We're going to use one scoop of the caramel cookie sticks, USB Labs protein powder, three tablespoons, which is about 50 grams of Greek yogurt, two-thirds of a cup of uh, pancake mix. Now, why pancake mix? Well, here's a couple reasons why. One, most of them are just add water only. You don't have to add a bunch of ingredients. Two, the cost, it's about $1.67, $1.70 a box. And three, the availability, buy them in your Walmart, buy them in your grocery stores. When you try and find these almond flours, coconut flours, they're very hard, very expensive, they make a very dry product. Regular flour is very high in GI. Also, it's going to be a lot more in calories, which is not what we're looking for when we're making a healthy recipe. Grab one of these pancake mixes that are add water only, local Walmart, local grocery store. Powdered peanut butter, we're going to use one tablespoon, which is 16 grams. I have this for my oatmeal. You can grab a PB2 at a local Walmart or a grocery store. And one egg. First step is going to combine our whey protein with our pancake mix, which are our dry ingredients. We're going to put that in a separate bowl. After that, we're going to crack our egg, and we're going to add our Greek yogurt, and mix it together until we form a batter. So I'm going to put a circular Tupperware container. Once our batter is mixed, as you can see here, I'm simply going to transfer this right into the bowl. And we are going to put this in the microwave for about three to five minutes on 50% power. Cake's cooking, let's make our lava filling. I have my serving or one tablespoon of powdered peanut butter. You're going to use right around one fourth of a cup of water, give or take a little bit. You want to add just enough to make a nice pudding like consistency. So add slow because you can't always take water back and just mix it with your spoon until you get a good cons consistency for the mud cake. It's done. You're just going to kind of firm around the edges like this and it should start to kind of pop out. With that said, all you got to do is take your mug cake and just flip it right onto a plate. It's that easy. So for the mug cake, you're just going to want to take a little circle like this so that way we can put our filling. As you can see, the mug cake is still hot. So as I apply the filling, it's starting to melt off the side. That's exactly. And as it continues to melt, the lava cake just drips off the side. That is your caramel cookie sticks. Lava cake. Directions, macros, and ingredients.